Why Goku will kill Black in Dragon Ball Super. Dragon Ball is a shonen, and it is very shonen. And it probably, out of everything I watched, and it probably the second most shonen thing in Shonen Jump, next to One Piece. One Piece is like the king of shonen tropes, that is without a doubt. But one thing that almost always happens in shonen manga is that the main character always gets the kill. This is a case in many other series. Let's look at some examples. So, there is a warning. Spoiler is ahead. The first example is Naruto vs. Pain in Naruto. Naruto defeated Pain. Another example is Luffy vs. Doflamingo, alright? Let's be honest, if you read One Piece, you know what I mean when I say it would have been much better writing for Law to get the kill. Not even, he, he didn't kill Doflamingo, but it would have been much better writing for Law to do it, but they didn't. Wanna know why? I mean, it's a shonen theory. And when people would ask me why I didn't think Law would kill Doflamingo or beat him, I would always say, because it's a shonen and Luffy is the main character. Luffy going to defeat the main villain. Let's look at Bleach. Bleach with Aizen. Yeah, this is a little controversial, but Kuro made Aizen very powerful, and when he realized Aizen was too powerful for Ichigo to defeat, he gave him a random app power-up in the final Getsu Gatentio, that Ichigo could use to beat Aizen. Why do these authors do this? Because these are the main characters. I'm not saying that's how it always is in every form of medium. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying like in Avatar The Last Airbender, Aang would have had to get the kill. Or something like that. I'm not saying that. But in a shonen series, it's kinda just a thing. If, if the main character either wins or they lose. But yes, there are other anime where the main character dies and somebody else takes over, but those aren't like the top selling shonen. Dragon Ball is like, Dragon Ball set the standard for shonen. Look at the big shonen nowadays, Naruto and One Piece. Look at those theories. Look at Luffy. Look at him. Just look at his personality for a moment. He is a lot like Goku. Why? Because he's made up of a lot of shonen tropes. He's a stupid main character that is very carefree and likes making friends. That is a lot like Goku. Naruto, just look at his outfit and his hair. Clearly based off of Goku. That's just the way it works. Even Naruto gradually with Sasuke. Dragon Ball set a standard, and I just don't see Dragon Ball deviating from that. I know some people want him to be killed, I mean, as in him being black, to be killed by Vegeta, or Trunks, or maybe even Gohan. But guy, does that really seem likely? Only one other character killed the main villain beside Goku. And that is Gohan in the Cell arc, but that would be good Toriyama, According to rumors, I'm not 100% sure this is true, I think it's an incorrect. But, there are there is that rumor that Toriyama wanted Gohan to become a main character. That isn't exactly true, from what I understand. But still, I mean, you could tell he was setting it up so Gohan could be, like, the main dude from now on. Gohan was meant to get the kill, and it closed the character arc. But, Goku still ended up killing Boo. Goku always delivered the final blow, and I know he doesn't technically kill all of his opponents, but still, Goku may not kill him. Maybe Goku won't kill Black, but he will defeat him first. I thought it, it just, it's a standard, alright? It's a standard and it's about an example. That's just my opinion though. I feel like just because Dragon Ball is what inspired all these other theories, and all these other theories wouldn't deviate from it, and these are theories with authors that, no offense to Toriyama, had much bigger balls than him. They're willing to take much, many more risks than him and do a lot more diverse, interesting, and complex storylines. However, they still fall back on those standards, like the main character always beating the main villain. So if those theories aren't going to have somebody else beat him, I don't know why Dragon Ball would. That's just my opinion, though. Tell me whether or not you think Goku will kill Black in the comment section down below. And tell me who you personally want to kill Black. And you could even say Yancha if you wanted. But guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave it a like. Comment your thoughts down below. Subscribe for more. And above all else, guys, have a great day.